Yeah, we started using that program last year. It's called Impact, uh, based on concussion testing. And what we do is each student will go onto a computer, take a 20 to 30 minute test. Um, it'll test out their reaction time, um, short term memory. And so we have a baseline of what how they would test on this. Then in the event that they do get a concussion, they would take the test again, and then the doctors will then take the results from the baseline and then the post-concussion test and compare the results. Uh, so we can see what areas the concussion has affected in their brain. Um, we do baseline testing now for three or four years with kids. Um, our protocol that we follow relative to treating concussion is so much better than it used to be. Um, I, let, I compare it to what we do with water and hydration. When I was a kid and played, I'm really old now, you didn't get water at practice. Now we have a carp loss practice anytime you want to get water. And I think what's going to happen with concussions is the same thing. We're going to, we've caught up now where we're going to handle it better. We probably handle it better even than the college and the pro guys because we know this is a, this is a extracurricular activity. Obviously we're very intense, we want to win, but the kids safety is the priority. We have a very good uh, training staff here with Susan Busher and um, what she says goes. I mean, they're very strict testing and, and I'm all for it. In fact, my son, who's going to be a sophomore this year, he's had his third concussion in four years. So uh, my wife and I, we're not letting him play football anymore. He's just going to have to stick with basketball and lacrosse and it's just not worth it. So It's their brain. They need that the rest of their lives and we want to make sure that you are doing every precaution possible to make sure that, you know, like I said, they don't go back into activity You're still having those symptoms. Um, you know, I, that's what I say is the biggest thing. Is that one, just be always extra cautious with it.